Hello my dear students today i am discussing about some questions and answers the topic name is file management organization of data part 10 the next slide is about some questions and answers question number 2 name the different components of a windows 7 desktop answer the different components of a windows 7 desktop are as follows number a icons number b gadgets number c start menu number d live thumbnail views number e notification area number f show desktop number 3 write short notes on number a arrow snap number b arrow flip 3d answer number a arrow snap this option helps to arrange two windows horizontally or vertically for better comparison number b arrow flip 3d this option enables to preview all open windows as a stack the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number 4 differentiate between aeropic and aeroshake features of windows 7 answer the difference between aeropic and aeroshake features of windows 7 are as follows aeropic this feature helps to view the desktop and its gadgets making all other open windows transparent aeroshake this feature helps to minimize all active windows except the one currently in use Question number five, which is only compulsory icon on the desktop? Answer: Recycle bin is only compulsory icon on the desktop. The next slide contains the next part of questions and answers. Question number six, write the steps to access the drives in the computer. Answer. to access the drives in the computer the steps are as follows number 1 click on the start menu to display the start menu number 2 click computer in the pan to view all the drives and hardware currently connected to the system question number 7 briefly explain how the hierarchy of folders and files is important answer the windows explorer illustrates the hierarchical arrangement of files folders drives and network drives on a computer it can be used to copy move rename and search for files and folders the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number 8 define file folder and a sub folder how can you create a new folder answer file files are the documents saved on a computer for future reference and use folder folder is a container for files any number of folders can be created a folder can also contain other folders sub folder a folder can also contain other folders these are also known as sub folder the steps for creating a new folder are as follows number 1 open windows explorer number 2 select the destination where the user wants to create a new folder number 
select new folder option from the toolbar. A blank new folder is created with a default name new folder. Number four, this folder can be renamed accordingly. Students, in this session, I have discussed about some questions and answers. That's all for now. Thank you.